Hello, welcome to Football Not In Focus. Now, it feels like football is slipping further and further away. I've even started watching Sunderland Till I Die, just to hear the drones of a crowd at a big public gathering. <sighs> God, I miss those. And a few of our favorite faces in the game are making preparations just in case it never returns. Ruben Loftus-Cheek has taken up selling fruit and veg. Cameron Prince Boateng is either working on becoming an actor or a doorman. Let's hope it's the latter for all of our sakes. And Manuel Neuer is becoming a backup dancer? But Spurs are staying focused for when it does finally return. Jose and his backroom staff have got the team on Zoom for group training sessions. Squat, drive up, drop down into squat nice and deep, drive up and squeeze. Again, you're looking for about five seconds each rep. Take your time, take your time. Now, I don't want to blow my own trumpet here, but I did suggest that last week in the video. For like Mikel Arteta to be like there with Zoom on, like, hey guys, morning, blah, blah, blah. You know, everyone can be in their garden, have it all set up. They could do the training session. <gasps> Great minds, Jose. Wait, does this mean I'm special too? Talking of special, the Portuguese manager made a special trip out in Cockfosters for some essentials before lockdown with his two bodyguards in tow. I mean, we've all seen how nasty it can get over that last packet of loo roll. Football might be staying home, but Jack Grealish isn't. After urging everyone to stay at home and do their bit, he's been out being a Jack the Lad. Don't go to parties and crash your bloody car. Especially when you're supposed to be a star. Cause it's quarantine, it made me lose my mind. But if we all do stick together, then we'll be just fine. He's since been fined and given a slapped hand. Don't worry guys, it was washed first. And David Beckham has upset more people than Carol Baskin this week by eating coleslaw with bangers and mash. Surely he's just doing what everybody else in the country is doing right now. I call this chuck whatever's left in the fridge and in day on a plate. Voila! And I'm going to leave this on a lovely positive note. Match of the day star Gary Lineker has donated two months salary to the British Red Cross to help with aiding the coronavirus pandemic. So it seems his heart is even bigger than his trademark ears. What a guy. So that's it for this week. If you see something you think I should feature in next week's show, then please do let me know. Till then, stay safe, wash your hands, and together we can get corona relegated.